It's a bar reach. Fire reach. Yo, 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 welcome back to another vlog. Welcome back, guys. Hope you guys are okay. Basically, guys, today's vlog, we are back on the escape and we are starting at Dar es Salaam International Airport. As I said and promised, we are heading to Zanzibar. Yes, the beautiful white sand island in Tanzania. Anyways, guys, we've checked in early morning flight today and we've got an hour to departure. And we'll be heading to the lovely Zanzibar. So stay tuned, keep watching. I'll update you. We've already checked in with security and we're heading to get something to eat. And hopefully we'll be heading uh, on our flight to Zanzibar. So stay tuned, keep watching. This is me at the uh, International Airport. And uh, I've just had my coffee, so I'm full of beans. So we'll catch up soon. Peace. Damn! Moments later. Yo guys, anyways, as I said, we are in Dar es Salaam International Airport, heading to Zanzibar and I love what they've done on the background there, you can see the wild animals, there's a zebra, giraffe, lion and uh, I like the posters and the pictures, obviously they've influenced how the uh, wildlife obviously plays a big role in Tanzania uh, Due to free shop here, you can get all the African um, uh, souvenirs if you like and uh, we've been to that shop before and it's amazing so if you've never been to Tanzania, especially Dar es Salaam Definitely worth checking out. It's a duty free shop. Can't go wrong for your souvenirs. But as I said, we are heading to Zanzibar this morning. We've uh, just come to get some snacks right now. And uh, you can get mishkaki actually in the morning if you want. The, bar uh, the barbecue beef skewers, as I said earlier, uh, we, which we had in town. So it's 6 in the morning, but if you want it, that's your thing, you can get it. Sausage, eggs, full, full on breakfast as well. You're good to go. Yo, yo. <laughs> Anyways guys, we've decided to have some snacks. We've got some samosas early in the morning. Mm. It's so tasty, juicy, fresh. And we've got um, a, a, the snack. It's, um, it's called mandazi. So it's like donuts basically. African donuts basically, which are fried. And uh, again, this place is amazing. There you go guys. Uh, breakfast at uh, Dar es Salaam. International Airport. Peace. Damn! Two hours later. Right, guys, it is that time again. We are boarding our flight to Zanzibar. There's a lovely F320 in Tanzania just on the left hand side, but uh, we are not flying with the Tanzania. We are flying via Flightlink, which is a domestic commercial airline, uh, obviously, uh, which uh, flies between the small regions. Uh, Tanzania. To be honest, it's a lovely, lovely weather today in Dar es Salaam. Uh, it feels amazing. It's not too hot, and the breeze is just lovely. As we head uh, to our flight, we are going to board the bus, which is going to take us uh, to the plane now, which is waiting on the runway. Anyways, uh, we'll uh, update you as we get to the plane. Uh, as I said, there's a lovely Air Tanzania F320 just across, uh, which is uh, the new place the government purchased here. 
Just a quick sign, just there, ATC, and we are on the bus now. Yo, yo, guys, we are here, and this is our transport to Zanzibar. This uh, small, lovely charter flight is going to take us to the lovely island of Zanzibar, and we are boarding now. There you go. So we'll see you on board now, guys. Yo, it's a tiny flight. Look at the stairs. I can to literally climb up the stairs. That's the wing bit. Oh my god. <laughs> and you have literally... <laughs> uh, you have to uh, step down just to get in. That's the cockpit just in the back. There you go. Yo guys, we are nearly ready to uh, take off from Dar es Salaam. And as you can see, it's really a tiny little plane. Just to get in, we have to literally bend down to get in. Because so, as you can see, I'm not too far from the uh, top of the plane. And uh, that's the lovely, lovely view outside of the runway. And uh, we're just doing last minute uh, flight checks before we take off. So there you go, Zanzibar, here we come. A few moments later Welcome to Zanzibar. We have arrived, guys. We are in the land of the white sandy beaches, and this is Zanzibar. Uh, this was our flight. To be fair, it was a short flight, a scary one because it's a tiny airplane. But we made it safe and sound, and we are going to enjoy the lovely sandy beaches in Zanzibar. Yo, we are on the airfield Zaka, Zanzibar Airport. As you can see, Zanzibar International Airport, we've just landed and this is uh, the scene here. Uh, we are live on the runway and uh, just arrived in Zanzibar, so we're going to enjoy the lovely white sandy beaches in Zanzibar. Zaga, Mo! Yo, yo! <laughs> it was scary, man. I've got to say, as soon as we got on the plane, I've never traveled in such a tiny plane. Uh, literally, we had to bend down just to get in. I mean, as you saw, when I was sat on the seat, the head was just here. So I was in panic station, but thank God, obviously, the pilots do this every day. So here we go. We're going to pass immigration now, and then we'll catch up with you outside. Uh, one hour late. Yo, guys, can you hear that? Whoa! It's thunder, we've just arrived at our uh, Palm Beach Resort in Zanzibar and the clouds are ready. As you can see, it's about to rain down. Uh, just our luck actually in Africa since we've come, it's been raining. Uh, so it's not too bad. But yeah, as you can see, we've got the villas. Obviously, we've got two bedroom villa uh, for a family of seven. And as you can see, these are the names of the vanilla, cinnamon, uh, Cardamom, so with the spices name basically, and these are the villas as you can see, they're amazing. The beach is just there, right at the end, uh, with an infinity pool. So we're looking forward to this. But obviously the cloud has just come up, it might just rain for a, for a bit, uh, until it settles down again, the sun comes out. But uh, as soon as we walked in, you could hear the thunder and lightning, wow. Anyways guys, this is Sunny Palm in Zanzibar, we're here. Yo. Right, so welcome to our two-bedroom villa. 
Ian Zanzibar, the Sunny Palms. Uh, massive 65 inch TV there. Lounge area. Dining table just there. Right, I'll show you the first room, guys. Whoa! Yo! Look at this, guys. This is sick of what? This is Zanzibar, bro. East Africa. We're trending, bro. Look at this. I'm gonna feel like a king, bro. I mean, that looks sick, guys. Right, so this is one bedroom, obviously. And then, uh, just quickly tour of uh, the facilities. Toilets, walk-in shower, sink. It's amazing. There's also a wardrobe to put your clothes in. There you go, guys. This is two-bedroom villa in Zanzibar. Peace. Oh, okay. Right. Welcome, my guys. So this is the biggest room we have. There's a double bed, there's a single bed. There's an extra mattress here. Obviously, because we've got big extended family. Uh, so this is a massive family suite. <laughs> Yo, welcome to Zanzibar, guys. This is amazing, amazing, amazing. And uh, there's an extra toilet there, but someone's already using it, obviously. So we'll show you a bit later. Peace. Yo guys, right, so this is the other bedroom as I'm saying. I like to be a touch, they put to be a roses and sprinkle the, the flags around, the petals around. Uh, I like it. You know, I mean, come on. As you can see, even on the single bed, there's a bit of a uh, uh, rose thing and they've uh, just uh, put down the petals everywhere. Yo, I like this. That extra touch makes it so special here. Damn! Moments later. Yo, yo! Greetings from the sunny palms in Zan Zanzibar. It's not really sunny. We've just come down and it started raining. The lighting. About just give you a quick, quick tour. This is a massive swimming pool, as you can see here. Uh, and there's like a, a beach bar, uh, uh, swimming bar there. Obviously, the beach uh, beds here. So we're gonna go quickly in the room, chill this rain uh, settles down, and then we'll come back, hopefully play in the pool. The restaurant is just there, as you can see, amazing, amazing restaurant there, facing the beach. The beach is just there, guys, as I said, it's an infinity pool, quickly straight to the beach, and you're good to go. But obviously, the rain is there to welcome us, <laughs> just in Zanzibar, uh, just to cool it down for us. So uh, we're headed to the room again. Yo, yo, so welcome back, guys. So we are at the Sunny Palm Beach bungalows, as you can see, guys. And fortunately, it's pissing it down, it's raining, so I uh, kind of has spoiled my mood. But we're still here to enjoy. So as soon as this cloud passes, the lightning passes and the rain goes away, we will be hitting that pool. Amazing, amazing pool. Uh, there's uh, a volleyball ground, there's also some children's area, and just outside the, the, the pool area, you can just walk straight to the lovely, lovely white sand private beach, guys. So a quick tour of the beach uh, while we're here. As you can see, oh wow, white sandy beaches, guys. As you can see, there's nobody here. You've got your own private area from the hotel. Uh, 
you know, just so you can enjoy and relax and have that extra privacy. This is Zanzibar, guys. Welcome. Welcome a lot to Zanzibar, the sunny Palm Beach bungalows. This is how we do it in Africa. East Africa, guys, we've been to Zanzibar. This is the up and coming tourist area now. So make sure you check it out. Enjoy this lovely, lovely view. Obviously, when the sun comes out. Peace. Two hours later. <laughs> yo, yo, so welcome back. We are finally in the pool. Obviously, it's not sunny, but it stopped raining. So we decided to get into the pool and just uh, uh, make the most of, obviously, what we have. We're here for three days in the resort. Uh, hopefully, we'll be going out for dinner, uh, coming back, and hopefully tomorrow we've got um, a day visit in Stone Town and uh, just to check out, obviously, the surrounding and uh, what's going on. But this is most of the time we'll be spending in the sunny palm resorts in Zanzibar. I just hope it's sunny at some point so we can enjoy it. Anyways guys, we're gonna enjoy the pool now and we'll catch up with you later. Two hours later. Yo, yo, so welcome back, guys. Right, as you can see, we have just come out to chill out on uh, the obviously <laughs> uh, sleeping beds. Uh, we are tired, we've been playing for at least two, three hours in the pool, and uh, the weather's changed again. I don't know if you guys can see. Uh, it's going a bit uh, cloudy again, uh, looks like it's the rain. So we're just going to chill out for a while, uh, order, we've just got the menu actually, uh, so we can see uh, what's up uh, on the menu, so we can order our lunch, and then uh, just head uh, to get some lunch because we're hungry. Obviously we didn't even have breakfast this morning, we left Dar es Salaam, very early hours of the morning, got here and straight hit the pool guys. Anyways, we are chilling in Sunny Palms in Zanzibar, peace. Yo guys, one thing, there's palm trees all over the resort and uh, look at this, this is so cool. There's a coconut tree just here. As you can see, I could literally touch the coconut just there. It's so amazing, man. Everything is just natural and it's there in uh, the palm of your hand. Uh, amazing, amazing uh, pool, obviously, here. And the coconut tree, man, that's, that's just so funny. It's in a touching distance. Uh, as you can see, this is a view we have. And uh, this is like uh, the tower rack. They just leave some tower racks here for you. So you can grab one and help yourself. Anyways, we're going to chill out for a while here. <clears throat> Probably walk on the beach, uh, order some lunch and uh, just get on with the day. Uh, we arrived at 8 in the morning, obviously in Zanzibar from Dar es Salaam. And it's currently just getting to uh, 12 o'clock in the noon. So there you go, guys. Chilling in Zanzibar, Palm Resort, sunny Palm Resort. One hour later. Yo yeah, guys, you know you're in the nice resort when they cut the mangoes and serve you in a design. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> so we're chilling at Sunny Palm in Zanzibar. Which style? But it's raining outside. <laughs> That's it, we've come inside and eating some fresh, fresh seasonal fruits. Yo, so welcome back guys. Right, so we've ordered our lunch. But we've decided to come to the playroom for now. As you can see, there's table tennis, ping pong, there's air hockey over there, there's uh, the football table, there's a pool table, right? And also, like I said, a lovely, lovely sitting area there, facing the beach. Guys, sunny palm in Zanzibar. This is the luxury man. Uh, I wasn't expecting it, obviously, look at the pictures, but come in here. I'm well, well impressed. So big up, Sunny Palms in Zanzibar. Uh, it's amazing to be here, to experience this lovely, lovely holiday in Zanzibar. Peace.
one hour late. Right, so we have come for the lunch in the resort, and uh, I have uh, the authentic chicken biryani. It comes with uh, papadum, some eggs, and uh, the biryani itself. While well, Big Mo has got the grilled calamari. So there you go, and we've also got chicken tikka. Royal style. <laughs> anyway, we can enjoy our lunch uh, in the, the <coughs> Sunny Palm Resort in Zanzibar. Compliments to the resort. Bon appetit. Damn! One hour later. Yo, yo, so welcome back, guys. So we have come out for dinner tonight uh, at a place called Meat Point. Yamachoma in Zanzibar and we have come to Stone Town and what they do is they serve you in a thing called Sinia, right? And they put different different pieces of meat, there is uh, goat meat, sheep, there is cow, uh, it's all barbecued, there is seafood as well and uh, a bit of chips as well and they put different sauces on it. So there you go guys, we're gonna feast on this Sinia today and enjoy ourselves in Stone Town and you can see Mr. Mo there with his friend Mr. Babanga. If you come to Zanzibar, ask Mo, he'll give you his contact. He's been lovely taking us around. So he's someone really with a lot of knowledge of Zanzibar. So stay tuned, keep watching. I'll get back to you guys after we've feasted. Yo, so welcome back guys. Right, this is the joint midpoint in Zanzibar, Yamachoma Grill. We've just been round. It's only a small local place, but the meat is amazing. Uh, like I said, they bring you in the Sinia, all the mixed meat uh, features, and uh, the taste is amazing. It's all barbecued on the charcoal grill. Anyways, guys, this has been our night. We are heading out just to um, tour a bit more Stone Town for now uh, in the night time, and uh, we'll be heading back uh, to the resort shortly. Anyway, stay tuned, keep watching. We'll update you now as we move on. Many unbearable hours later. Yo, so welcome back guys. It is currently 11 o'clock p.m. Anyways, we have just come down to our local uh, uh, private beach by our resort. And as you can see, this is the view of the night on the beach. We're planning to sleep here, but there's crabs walking around. So it's going to disturb my sleep. Anyway, there's like a uh, sleeping beds just uh, above by the swimming pool. We're just gonna chill here till the get, kids get tired and uh, we are ready to go to bed because tomorrow is another day in Zanzibar. Anyways, guys, we are enjoying our holiday in Zanzibar here. Uh, hope you guys are enjoying your Easter holidays as well. So, happy Easter to everybody. Anyway, stay tuned, keep watching. There's always more to come, as you know. Peace. Yo, yo, so welcome back, guys. Right, this has been our day. Hope you enjoyed in, uh, our videos in Zanzibar. What I'm gonna do here is wrap this vlog here. Remember, if you're new to the channel, subscribe down below because there's more Zanzibar to come and there is still more twisted turns to come in our African, East African, Tanzanian holiday as there is still a lot more to come. Anyways, guys, with this, are yours. Have a good night, have a good sleep, and we'll catch up with you on the next vlogs. 